Hi everybody, happy Tuesday. Did you know there is going to be a total solar eclipse on April 8th? Well, I have a book to share with you about solar eclipses. And this book is A Few Beautiful Minutes, Experiencing a Solar Eclipse. It is written by Kate Allen Fox and it is published by Little Brown. And we wanna thank them for allowing us to share this book with you today. So are you ready to find out what this book is all about? Let's get started. And right here on the end pages, it shows a solar eclipse. Under a broad blue sky from coast to coast, we gather for a rare illusion, a total solar eclipse when the sun vanishes into thin air for a few beautiful minutes. Did you know that's what it was? In the endless expanse of space, the universe prepares for a show, one the sun and moon have given us since the dawn of time. They find their places as the performance begins. The sun, forever the star, beams vast and vibrant, her stage unchanged. But the moon has already begun, gliding, sliding, slipping into the spotlight to steal the sun's glory for a few beautiful minutes. And it looks like they're getting ready to view it. Little by little, she hides the sun. Our eyes alone can't see the change. The sun still too bright can burn them for life. So we look through our sun viewers and see that the glowing giant seems shrunken, her circle chipped into a crescent. In the shadows of trees, slivers of light mirror the sun's shifting silhouette. The moon moves farther and farther in front of the sun, a small sphere striving to overshadow a giant for a few beautiful minutes. Moment by moment, for an hour or more, the stage transforms, the sun grows slimmer, the sky dimmer as a midday twilight takes shape. The world grows more dark than light and eerie orange hues hug this horizon. Above us, the sky becomes as dark as the deep sea. Stars shining brighter than ever twinkle in that darkness. Birds roost for the night as crickets and bats wake. Temperatures plummet as the chill of night nips at our ears. In the cold, in the dark, in anticipation, we wait for those few beautiful minutes. The last rays of light fade away and the moment arrives. The corona, the sun's atmosphere or crown, now shimmers round the moon, the unlikely queen of the solar system. <clears throat> the corona's lighting like tentacles grasp at space. Their glow dances in our eyes, all of us aware of our own tininess, all captivated and connected for those tiny, precious minutes. In the crowd is one tiny, precious you. Arms spread wide in the sweet, cool grass under a velvet panorama, you come face to face with the splendor of the universe for a few beautiful minutes. But it cannot last. All shows must end. The moon glides on, the sun reemerges, reclaiming her daylight throne. As light creeps back to earth, we look around at one another. Once strangers, now we are friends. People who together glimpse the extraordinary. Speechless, we smile, we hug and high five. We remember all that we saw. For a few beautiful minutes.
to the end. And then if you come out and come in and check out this book, there are a whole lot of facts about what is a solar eclipse. So you definitely want to read this and find out more. The end. And if you would like a pair of glasses so that you can safely view the solar eclipse, we have four programs starting on April 1st. And if you attend one of our programs, you can get a free pair of glasses. We hope to see you at one of them. And if you want more information, check out our calendar on our Instagram page or come in, visit me and pick up a paper copy. We'd love to see you. I will be back on Thursday with another brand new book to share. So until then, everybody have a great couple days and start thinking about which of the programs you want to come to see. Bye for now.